anyways, I'm talking kind of low because our bedroom wall is right there and Shauna's still asleep. But anyway, welcome back to our channel. If you are new here, um, welcome. I just went over 300 subscribers, which sounds so little compared to so many people. But I started with 19 a few years ago, so it's taken me a long time. But um, thank, thank you for um, joining us on our journey. Um, I hope that we can provide some content that you're interested in. Um, I'm a mom. I am 45 years old, and I have a three-year-old. <laughs> and I have a lot of mobility issues. And so, um, anyway, I'm just going to um, share with you guys today our big news. Uh, Harrison is pretty much potty trained. Um, he still won't poo in the toilet, but... Um, but he's got peeing down. So I'm talking to you about that and how that happened today. Um, I just showed you a little bit of my uh, morning routine. I made some coffee. Um, I just boiled some water and I'm gonna make me some oatmeal. I usually have like a whole grain bagel, but um, my sugar was a little higher this morning. So anyway, um, I've got oatmeal and I've got some craisins and I'm gonna put some Truvia brown sugar in there and then put some hot water on it. So ignore my dirty kitchen. My hands are really bothering me this morning, so it's kind of hard to open things and lift things. So let me start with that and see how that, because this stuff goes a long way. But anyway, um, I gotta do my medicine in just a minute and sort it because my little thingy is out. So that's what's going on. I'm just gonna talk to you guys. Um, about Harrison. Oh. Pour some hot water in there. You can always add more oats. And then uh, take it in there to my desk, which is what I usually do in the morning. I usually take it into my, my food or my coffee into my desk and open my computer up and kind of just get my day started. <laughs> Harrison's in there playing. He has usually a, cho he calls it a chocolate granola bar, but it's actually uh, a protein bar. So, he's in there playing, and uh, yeah, I'm going to get my day started. What you playing? Car crash. Car crash? <laughs> he is trash the living room. He takes all the cushions down. Does anybody else's kids do this? He takes all the cushions off the couch and then like plays with his cars on the couch. <laughs> My house is wrecked all the time. This kid is a mess. Are you a mess, Bubba? Mess. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get back to work. You play. Granola bar. You found a fazzy somewhere. 
he actually has been doing really good about passies, but this last week he's wanted to hold on to it a little bit more. You, he was getting to where he was like just throwing it in the bed when he got out of bed, which was perfect. Because I don't mind him having it to sleep. Yeah. Because he has some sensory issues, but wow. anyway, he's been a little bit more clingy to Julie. it this week. Julie. What are those? Your monster trucks? So, here's what happened. What? Uh, Last Thursday night, we, um, and let me back, let me back tell you that I feel like he's been ready for a while. It's just I've been stuck on this thing and my mobility and my ability to get around has been so bad that I just wasn't ready. I just didn't think I could do it. And so, um, <laughs> he did it on his own. Um, because I knew he knew how, you know, but... He was, I wasn't uh, doing it. So last Thursday night, right before bed, we all got into bed. Um, he sleeps with us. And he's like, I mean, we were like turning the lights out and everything in bed. And he said, I got to go pee pee. I was like, okay, go pee pee. So he got up and our bathroom is in our bedroom. It's on suite. And he ran in there and pulled his um, diaper down. I went pee pee. So we praised him and it was like, yay, you're such a big boy. Yeah, baby. Yeah. And so he went pee and so we made a big deal about it. So the next morning I got him up and um, yeah. And I didn't um, have him go pee pee right away because Sean usually stays in bed. So we got up and came in here and I, I left, leave, leave his diaper on. But then like um, after Sean got up and around and stuff, I went ahead and put big boy pants on him and he did really good he had a couple of accidents where he would like start to go and he'd like oh no so we'd say okay run and go back go on to the bathroom and go pee pee and so a couple of times we had to put new underwear on him um in fact that evening he was laying in bed and he started to pee pee and he was like oh no not again <laughs> and so he jumped up i'm talking about you and you know it yeah hold on baby and so he jumped up and went into the bathroom and finished peeing so even then he was like able to hold it back after he started. So it took like one day for him to be aware that, oh, I have to be. And then like the next couple of days, um, we got, we got up in the morning and went peed and he did great. He didn't have any accidents. Um, he did poop the second day in his underwear because he just, he goes and hides when he poops. And so, um, he didn't, he was scared. He said he was scared. And so, um, over the weekend he did good. Um, and, um, then this week he's done great as well. Um, he has pooped a couple times. I've been able to put a diaper on him and him or pull up. And then, um, Tuesday night he did poop in his, in his, um, in his underwear. Uh, but that was okay. I know that, um, from everything that I've heard, uh, it's a process. The pooping comes a little later, so we'll work with him on that. But yeah, he's potty trained. I mean, he can wear big boy pants. He can hold it. In fact, this week, you did find a cow. This week, um, when we get up in the mornings like this and Sean is still in bed, um, and he'll hold it. The last few mornings, I've noticed he'll be like crossing his legs and squirming, and, I, and I'm like, do you have to go pee-pee? And so I'll say, let's go pee-pee, and he'll run in there and go pee-pee. Um, this morning, I just went ahead and when we got up, just took him pee-pee. So, um, he's really, like, he's so aware now. He knows how to hold it. Um, he's just doing so good. And so, such a big thing. I didn't even have to do anything. He kind of just did it on his own. I think he was like, Mom, I'm tired of waiting on you. I'm just going to do this. So, hopefully it doesn't take too too long for him to start learning how to, or be comfortable pooping. The thing with pooping is he has some difficulty and so sometimes he doesn't poop every day and it takes him a while and it's a little hard for him and it's big like when he poops it's big and so um i think it's going to be a little harder for him than it would be some kids that has just a little bit of poop you know and they just that's it so anyway yeah we're great um he's doing great he's got big boy pants on and he's doing really good so and I, I feel like we can even go out and about now. Um, the other day when we went to church, he wore big boy pants. Um, that was the day that he did um, he did poop. I had a pull-up on him to poop in, and he pooped in it. 
Then when I put his big boy pants on, he pooped in those too. So it's okay. Um, so yeah, we're excited that this has happened and it's a big milestone, a big step that I've been avoiding for a long time, honestly. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready to commit to it. And I didn't have to. He did it on his own. <laughs> hey, listen. You want your poo poo gummies? Um, poo poo gummies. Yeah, come up here. Do you need to go pee pee? Mm -mm. Are you sure? Mm -mm. Okay. Let's just go. Let's go pee pee real quick. You haven't pee pee since you woke up. Okay. Good job, Bubba. Watch your pee pee. Watch your pee pee. Remember, you gotta put the lid down and flush and do all your stuff when you're done. Good job. All right, guys, that's pretty much how it goes. Um, yeah, so he's really good about going in there on his own. He knows how to do it. He reaches really well. Um, he doesn't pee sitting down, he pees standing up, and he leans over and he does a good job. Um, so, yeah, that's. I just kinda wanted to let you guys know that he's pretty much potty trained out of the blue and kind of show you what we do in the mornings. It's really not much. You know, I make me a little something to eat, make the coffee and um, pretty much just work on my computer and just office work type stuff while he plays and watches his show. So I've got a few more things to do this morning. I'm kind of tired this morning. I look awful. I know I have not got ready yet. Got to make this bed and then, um, I've got to fold some laundry. So anyway, thank you guys for joining. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed uh, the information, give me a big thumbs up. It helps me. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe so you can see all the stuff going on. I'm going to do an update soon on his OT therapy and speech therapy. Um, so be watching for that if that's something that you're interested in. And um, yeah, we're going to leave you for now. And um, yeah, thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time. Bye. Thank you.